a lot of people always say like, oh, what do you have your temperature on when you flat iron your hair, baby, 450? Here we are again, honey. We are back. This is the second silk press of the fall, and it's time to get a pop in. As y'all can see, my silk press did not last. My roots are wavy, my edges curly, my scalp is itchy, it's oily, I got wet in the shower, it feels dirty, it feels crummy, like it feels just nasty. I am going to wet my hair, do a little quick hot oil treatment, and I'm just going to use regular oil y'all, extra virgin olive oil that you really should be using to cook with. That hot oil treatment is my deep conditioner for today. So I just have water in this water bottle. What I'm gonna do is, since I don't have like a um, blow dryer, get in the shower with a, like, a little cap on, a plastic cap, and then I'm gonna do my shower stuff. I'm gonna wash my face. I, you know, brush my teeth with my hands. Do a little scrub, and hopefully that's enough time to allow the oil to like penetrate in my scalp for at least 15 minutes. A lot of people always say like, oh, what do you have your temperature on when you flat iron your hair, baby, 450? If you wanna use like some cheaper oil, this is some really expensive like cooking oil that you can use like to cook. Okay, so this is how my hair look all oiled down and my ends are not straight. They just look like that. That's it. This is how my little ponytail looking. And then I'm just gonna twist it. Yep, I'm just gonna twist it. Put this little hair bow on it. When I start using this hair oil, like in a routine, that's when I seen the most growth in my hair. So I'm gonna actually put this on my scalp too. On top of that olive oil. But I'm gonna massage that in my scalp as well. And it helps like ease when my scalp gets like really irritated and like just irritating and itchy. And I'm gonna take a shower, y'all. I don't know if I told y'all, but I'm gonna put a plastic bag, y'all, on my head. Mm -hmm. Alright, y'all, so we are back and my hair feels really really moisturized i can't even lie look how much the curls are popping my hair feels really good so like i said all i did was basically do a hot oil treatment took a shower washed my face and then i did a shampoo twice i didn't do um a clarifying shampoo this time i did a moisturizing like pantene shampoo but i did it twice and then i used the pantene conditioner um, on my hair, let that sit for a couple minutes, and then I rinsed out. So this is where we're at right now. So now we're gonna do the handy dandy blow dryer. Um, I'm trying to think, do I wanna like add something to it or do I just wanna blow dry regular? Um, I don't know y'all, I may just blow dry regular. We gonna see. I don't know, I may take time, who knows? I may take time to do it. But yeah guys, so I should really be done with everything within like 30 minutes, because it takes me no time to flat iron my hair. The blow dryer really just takes the longest. So we are using the handy dandy chi, and then the bio silk, of course, y'all already know what time it is. Everything I use will be in the description box below. So I'm just spraying the heat protectant. You know, now that I'm feeling better, doing better, things are just gonna get better. When I'm going through shit, it's the end of the world, baby, for me. <laughs> like, it feels like the end of the world. But it really isn't. And I am really trying so hard, y'all, to regulate my emotions. I also understand about me that I have control issues. It's a struggle for me. Like, I didn't even realize it was, like, a problem until I started, honestly, dating. I'm 
Okay, y'all, so this is half of it done. We're just being blown out. Not too bad. I'm going to do the other side. Okay, y'all, so here we are finished. I basically pressed it straight this time. I may come back and show you guys, like, I'm going to get those silk rollers so that way I can start getting some body in my hair. So once I do that, I'm going to show you guys how I install them and how they look the next day. I feel a little bit of waviness in my roots, so I just kind of want to, you know, just make sure that stuff is straightened out. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah. This is what we are looking like. Bare face. Let's see. Yeah. So, this is what we are looking like. 
after the silk press so silk press season all right y'all so thank y'all so much for watching this is the second silk press of the year. What I did different this time was the hot oil treatment. And I definitely feel the difference in my hair. My hair definitely feels super soft. Um, I do kind of want like a, a more straight cut. But my hair is naturally in layers. So I kind of always say like if your hair grows in layers, why would you kind of cut it straight? Because it's going to keep on growing in layers. And you're going to keep on cutting the length off. So I just try to cut the split ends as I see them. The bottom, I try to just kind of snip, snip even. And then everything else is in layers. So... So yeah, maybe I'll come back when I have my um, my makeup done so that way you guys can see how everything just flows for church tomorrow. Love y'all. Bye.